Okay, we are back again to this incredible 1959 Viking Husqvarna Model 4010. Again, I can't say enough about what it can do from a heavy-duty standpoint. And you know what? We're going to demonstrate that again right now with sewing two layers of genuine cowhide. You know what? You don't see this kind of stuff on eBay. You don't see it pretty much anywhere uh, apart from the videos that I produce and, and the sew-offs that I do on camera. And we do them on camera because we don't want to just lay a bunch of sew-offs there and make the buyer question, you know, well, was it really sewn or not on that machine? We always put the proof where the pudding is and demonstrate it on camera, even with two layers of genuine cowhide. Now, if you've already seen the other video, you saw how easily this Model 4010 went through this single layer of genuine cowhide. Let me match these up a little bit so you can see them side by side. We went through this single layer of genuine cowhide like it was nothing, and we're going to go ahead and raise the stakes now by two going through two layers. So follow me down to the needle and I'll show you what this incredible machine can do with a task that really quite honestly is unbelievable when it comes to the difficulty of getting something like this uh, underneath the presser foot and getting the machine to go through it. But again our servicing process is what the difference is. Alright enough talk here we go two thick layers of genuine cowhide. All right, I started out slow like the other leather so off, but you know what? This machine just jumps in and says, all right, let's go, let's get her done. Look at that. Just like that single layer, let me do them like this so the camera can, you can see them side by side. Just like the single layer, apart from the fact that on the single layer I sewed just a little bit straighter. <laughs> I always sew off a little bit, but our double layer Look at that stitch quality. The spacing, the formation, everything about it is just spot on. And I'm going to go ahead and rotate it around like this because I did a better job of lining it up on this end. Look at again what we went through. Those two th super thick layers of genuine cowhide. And then remember how easy that machine got it done. And if I turn this around, look at that lock-in stitch. Now let me ask you a question. Lock-in stitches really demonstrate the reserve of power of a machine when it comes to getting a nice quality lock-in stitch as you see it here. Did you see any struggle with this machine at all apart from me starting out slow? It just went through these two layers of leather like it was a light textile. So you know what? If you're looking to do heavy duty sewing with leather, heavy duty sewing with quilting, doesn't matter what it is. This Model 4010 will get the job done and make it look like child's play.